This is Pi, the most interactive and conversational chatbot in the world right now. So if you are an English language learner who wants to have a conversation in English as if you were talking to a native speaker, Pi is for you. The concept of Pi came about from the simple fact that most current AI chatbots like ChatGPT are focused on being general chatbots, which means that their responses are not tailored for you as an individual. Also, these chatbots like ChatGPT give you the answers in text only, which is a problem if you were trying to learn how to make a conversation in English. But what choice do we have? That is until Pi, which has an interesting solution for you if you want to learn how to speak English or if you were looking for a conversational partner or a coach. I've tested Pi for you and it stands out because it has three features that other chatbots like ChatGPT do not have. Number one, conversational style, two, platform availability, and three, personalization. Pi stands for personal intelligence, and the way it works is simple. Like ChatGPT, you can type your message into the chat space, and this can be a question, a statement, or anything you'd like, and then Pi provides a response. However, the difference with ChatGPT is that Pi has a voice. You can turn on the audio feature to hear Pi reading the response to you. Sure thing. That's actually one of the things I was designed for. I'd love to help you improve your English. How about we get started by talking about your current English abilities and goals? You even have four different voices to choose from. All of the voices used in Pi are high quality text to speech voices that sound very natural and engaging. You won't hear any robotic tones or stilted or choppy responses. The voices are designed to sound like a real person is talking to you. Sure thing. That's actually one of the things I was designed for. I'd love to help you improve your English. How about we get started by talking about your current English abilities and goals? This makes it easier for you to understand and engage with Pi. Now, what if you wanted to speak with it and not type? As of right now, Pi doesn't have a built-in speech-to-text feature, but I have a solution for you. If you are using Windows, you can use the voice-to-text feature. Just open it up and start speaking. My level in English is advanced, and I would like to develop my fluency. Awesome, that's a great goal, and I can definitely help you with that. Can I ask, what are your specific goals for improving your fluency? For example, do you want to speak more smoothly, have a larger vocabulary, or something else? This way, you can talk to Pi in real time as if you were talking to a real native speaker in English. If you are using the mobile app, just hit the mic icon on your keyboard and start speaking. Oh, speaking of the mobile app, one key difference between Pi and the other chatbots like ChatGPT is that you can talk with Pi anywhere on Instagram, WhatsApp, or Facebook Messenger. To do that, just click on the links that I've put for you in the description of the YouTube video. Now, how can Pi help you improve your speaking? Let's say you are preparing for the IELTS speaking test part one. You can ask Pi to act like your examiner. This way, you don't have to worry anymore about taking speaking classes or trying to find a native speaker on the internet to talk to to prepare for the IELTS exam. The last and most important difference between Pi and other chatbots is that it is personal. Pi learns about you, about who you are, and then personalizes the responses based on your conversations with it, which means that the more you talk to it, the better it knows you and the better are the conversations that you have with it. Pi can really feel like a real authentic conversational partner. So whether you are just looking for advice, learning to speak English, or teaching English, just make sure that you give Pi background information about you so that it gives you personalized responses that fit your needs. Hey, thanks for watching and peace.